anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the brakes! They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that breach. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with our team too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. Let's go, Artyom. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? Yeah, I don't know yet. I'm gonna check on that shelter, but a full day at least. I see. Get to it, then. Spartans, let's prepare the Aurora for defensive action. Stepan, Damir, get the perimeter. I'm on yes, sir. Duke. I need you to recon the immediate area. Got that, sir. Idiot, you give him cover from the Aurora. Yes, sir. Sam and Alyosha, stay in reserve. Yes, yes sir. sir. Wait, am I not trustworthy anymore? I'd tell you if it was the case, Sam. Now, cut the job. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Maybe they served the enemy, enslaved or something. Going down. Ah, that was great. Ah, a boat. You won't have to go swimming after all. The locals probably get around mainly by boats. Church. None seem to be armed. 
We'd better try the open approach. Let's not fire first, okay? Our father, Salanthius, has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. We are a peaceful lot, so please keep your weapons shield. And welcome! Exile them! Let them repent! Patience, brothers and sisters! Patience and tolerance! For ye must accept thy neighbors like the Lord accepts thee! To truly turn their hearts from sin towards the heavenly bliss of true faith! So let us forgive the child! For she knows not the folly of her words. Let us forgive, brothers. Let us pray for the souls of the sinners. And let us forgive the child as the Lord forgives us. Amen. Embrace salvation. Reject the folly and the sin. Amen. Amen. Reject. Dwellers won't even talk to heretics, but I'll tell you everything I've seen Our in this place all that year. Under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silentia has fooled them just like the locals, but unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here, and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us. Artyom, she's right. Get to the boat. We will rescue her later. Don't worry. Go! Nazi, I can get to during the sermon. And then what? So he, he was just there and then he was trying to be... Your father Have you seen the heretic, sister? 
Of course I did that either. So you have seen him? <laughs> Are you sure that was a heretic? What else? They say it was Satan himself. <laughs> and do you believe them? Well, they say that as soon as Father Serenti has finished his sermon, you see the flesh on the first plate and the heretic just finished. I knew it. Did they say my sulfur? No, they didn't. But they say that the satanic machine has a vat with sulfur and a vat with oil in it. And whoever gets seduced by the heretics gets looking for the blend them with women in oil, men in sulfur. And you believe me? That machine only has cold and water. All right, let's go look for him then. Grab him by the tail and horns when you find him. Lord, protect me. Has the hidden been found yet? Lord willing, we will find him. Keep looking. The heretic is still in here. Whale? It's fucking huge! The old man sent me out as a forward sentry, told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And so you subdue the occupation forces peacefully with a holy cross and a prayer. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? 
The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? But I have to say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with a dumb spyglass. Here though we do have a chance of finding some loot. There is this plane there. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. The shrimps are giving me trouble, though. I wish I could somehow talk to that catfish into chomping all those water bugs. How did Mowgli talk to the animals, I wonder? Speaking of Mowgli, we have the same blood type, you and I. Haven't you noticed? <laughs> Well, I guess you have to go now, Artyom. I feel your father-in-law training his binoculars on us to turn us into pillars of salt. <laughs>